Alright, I'm gonna go to patch you down. You got anything on you that's gonna stick me, poke me, harm, harm you? I'm, I'm gonna go and explain everything to you in a second, alright? But I just need to patch you down real quick. Alright. Um, my cell phone's in my right pocket and I've got some uh, socks uh, down my pants. Okay, wait, can I just ask why you have socks in your pants? You have socks? Socks on you? I mean, I mean, you wouldn't want to know anyway. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Jackson Austin 95 here with another episode of BIB LP every day on 5M guys. Welcome. I um, hope you guys are enjoying uh, my recent content. As you guys can tell, I do have the server open. Um, the server is actually just made public uh, a couple of minutes ago actually. I'm just not recording this video just after the upload I just posted. So um, we, I have my deputy director in here and I have two other people who joined. So we're going to go ahead and jump in here and start some RP. Um, obviously the Sandy Shorts is going to be the AOP too. Today, so we're gonna go ahead and I'm just cruise around and see exactly, um, exactly what can, you know, exactly what's going on. Now, it looks like there's a traffic tap right up here. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and I don't want to stop. Um, actually, look, let me just let me just make sure he's okay because I have no clue what's going on. Oh shit, he's in here because let's go ahead. And, let's go ahead. All right, I don't know if there's gonna be another individual inside the car, so um, okay, let's actually go to make contact with him just to make sure he's okay. Hey, how's it going? Is everything alright? <clears throat> alright, Sheriff, yeah. I uh, just got this guy because he was doing a couple of burnouts at the sheriff's station. So, right, decided to pull him over and... That's not smart. Yep, he's, uh, his license is invalid, so... I just detained him for now. Just so I can conduct a search and okay. see what comes up. If, you know. So, just... Oh, shit. My bad. Didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Yep, there it is. Yep, my bad. Alright, um, yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna go to take off then. Looks like you're all set. If you need me, just go ahead and type it in text chat. I'll be around. Alright, so it looks like, uh, I'm sure. you guys already sure. Yeah, what's Could up? you come back? Yeah. Yeah, I've got this, uh, small bag of white powder. Okay. Yeah, no, 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 no. It's a bit of cocaine, so I'm gonna go ahead and arrest, arrest him on suspicion. Okay, yeah, like just detain him until you actually oh. test it. You have to test that first. Don't detain him just because it's a white substance. That could be anything inside there. So go ahead and test it first. Just detain him as of right now. Um, if you test it and yep. if it comes back blue, obviously, you know, it's going to come back. Oh, okay, you're ready. All right. You're like, just go ahead and test that. I'll, yeah, if you want, just go ahead and head to your car. I'll go ahead and watch him. I'll watch him for you while you go ahead and do that. All right. All right, appreciate that, Sheriff. Yeah, no problem. Hey, what's going on? What's going on today, man? How you doing? Oh, I'm going alright. Doing alright? Now, what's going on today, man? Like, you, like you, look, you, you look like you got yourself in a whole lot of trouble here. Um, there's nothing. Um, there's nothing wrong with me. Alright, um, so what's... Alright, uh, what's the bag? I mean, what's inside the bag? <clears throat> uh, it makes me happy. Uh, my a friend gave it to me. But, uh, officer, I mean, if you want to, we could all, uh... With this all slide and uh, uh fortunately i can't do that uh, excuse me Come on, officer. you want to repeat that again sir i don't think i heard you correctly you want to repeat that i mean i could uh okay all right all right so is that um is that is that that type of robbery is that what you is that what you're trying to trying, trying to go with here are you bribing me right now uh, now just uh, bring in a bit of diamonds into your life. Okay, I right, just gonna just have a seat for me real quick, right? Hey, um, Dep um, Highway, did you go ahead and pat him down? You searched him, right? He doesn't have anything on him. I'm gonna go ahead and have him sit down real quick. Okay, I don't think he heard him, but let's go ahead and have yeah, him yeah, sit yeah. down. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just searched him. It was just a small bag of white powder. And my big pee pee, if you want to talk. And so he's gonna just have a seat right here for me, okay? Gonna have a seat. 
All right, we're gonna go ahead. Um, I don't know what's going on with this guy. Looks like he's been doing burnouts in the parking lot. So I'm not even too sure of the full evidence um, that we have. Obviously, we have a white substance which is being tested right now, possibly um, cocaine or meth. So we're gonna go ahead and have him have a seat. Okay. I should get him on a bribery charge because he was also talking about doing some very disgusting things to me, which I really don't want. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and search his car real quick. Has this car been searched? I have no clue. Hey, I'm highway. Has this car been searched yet? Right, um, I don't think so. I don't no, know. I haven't touched that yet. I've just been testing this white powder that's coming back positive for cocaine. So, um, if you can go ahead and search the vehicle, I'll I'll read him his rights. <clears throat> okay, um, yeah, that's fine. Actually, um, I would. Uh, never mind. I, never mind. I was gonna have him go ahead and put him inside the car, but never mind. He's he's fine. He's not gonna get up. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and search his car. I'm not to show what exactly he has inside his car. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and search the car, right? Um, you know, due to the um, the white bag of um, powder substance, due to that, when it comes back, we're gonna go ahead and have to search the car, right? If that comes back positive for cocaine, right, or any type of um, narcotics, right? Um. Okay. Yeah, sheriff. So it's come back positive as cocaine. So oh, okay. yep, you will be going to jail the same. Yep, yeah, go ahead and get him up. Put him inside yep. the cruiser. I'll go ahead and search Time his for. car. All right. So it looks like uh, looks like he's pretty much all done. No, I don't swing that way yet. <laughs> he said I don't swing that way. I said like, go ahead and get it for me. Oh god. All right. Um, you know, obviously today is the first day that these guys are actually joining the community, so I haven't really told them what scripts they can use and um, you know how to use them. So right now we're going to be using a text chat. There's obviously scripts for it. Um, drag. All right, looks like I found a uh, empty bottle of um, alcohol inside here. I'm not even too sure if he's actually been drinking or not, but we're gonna go ahead and talk to my highway patrol officer to see if he sees, um, you know, any signs of, um, you know, possible intoxication. So, <clears throat> hey, what's up? I found um, I found this empty bottle of um, vodka inside his vehicle. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure if he's, um, you know, possibly intoxicated. I wasn't really next to, you know, too close to him, too close with him. So, do you have any suspicion that he's possibly intoxicated under alcohol? Because I've, you know, e either right. way, this is still an arrestable offense driving with the um, open alcohol container. So, I just oh, want to yep. make sure. I just want to make sure yeah, that, yep. um, you know, we can possibly add DUI on him on top of if he's um, intoxicated. Well, there's been nothing really that would suggest DUI, but. I'll do a PBT on him anyway. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Um, yeah, you can actually go ahead and do that at the station. So I'm going to go ahead and take inventory of his vehicle. I only found an empty bottle. So you can go ahead and add that on to his list of charges tonight. So, um, you know, obviously possession of um, cocaine and um, driving around with the empty alcohol, um, al alcohol container. Yep. All right, will do. Okay. Thanks for the help, Sheriff. Um, yeah. Would you like me to call a tour or are you going to organize up? Um, I can go to take care of that. Don't worry about it. You're going to book him in. All right. Appreciate the help, Sheriff. Have yeah, a good no one. Problem. Yeah, you too, bro. All right, guys. So that's going to wrap us up for that first call. Uh, I'm actually going to just go ahead and delete his vehicle. Oh, no. um, is that a car? All right, so, so at this time, you are under arrest. You oh, have the right shit. to remain silent. Anything you say will be used in the court of law okay, as I evidence. If you do not have an attorney, can oh, afford one. One will be pointed to you. Super loud. Do you send these rights I have read to you and you wish to speak to me? I gotta get away from Paul. Oh shit, I gotta, gotta, I gotta get away from Paul real quick. His voice is just um, like too loud, his mic. Call my phone number first or do I get straight to business? Nah, so I don't know what's going on. Neither, sir. That guy is obviously on some type of... Could you answer the question? Anything, do you so. understand your rights? Nah, yeah. Alright guys, looks like I got a word from the um, 911 caller. We actually went to contact the 911 caller again, and it looks like the driver is going to be last known on Marina Drive. So let's go ahead and head back towards Marina Drive. It's going to be on a gray vehicle, so we're going to be looking for any... <clears throat> oh my god, I literally lost my voice there for a second. I need something to drink. I'm like parched. Um, yeah, so we're going to head towards Marina Drive. My voice is cracking. Oh my god, this is horrible. It's going to be on a gray vehicle. I have not spotted any gray vehicles yet. Um, I'm on the back of Marina Drive. I'm looking down every street possible. I do not see any signs of, um, you know, anyone being struck by a vehicle or 
anything like that. So let's actually go ahead and just try to respond down the street, I, I guess. I don't really know what else to do. Oh, shit. Okay, I got eyes. I got eyes on a great vehicle. Hey, man, stop right there, dude. Stop right there. Stop right there, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, go and show me your hands. Show me your hands. Oh, shit. Do I go ahead and talk? Oh, fuck. There Show me your hands. Nope. Show me your hands. Yeah. Four, sl four slash H-U. Hands up, buddy. Hey. Come on, man. All right, go ahead and turn around for me. Come on. Turn. I've, I've not done anything wrong. All right, slowly turn around. All right, do you got any weapons on you? No, 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 no. Not, none at all? All right, what you gonna do? You're gonna no, go ahead and take five steps weapons. backwards, all right? Go ahead and take five steps backwards. I'll get you back, Sheriff. Copy. All right, stop right there. Stop right there. Stop right there. All right, go ahead and just do not move, right? One King, just have to get my back. Oh, okay. Got my six. Lesson, take six. Lesson, lesson. All right, guys, so we're going to go don't, ahead. Don't, 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 don't. Don't. I, I didn't mean it. Okay. I just. Oh, fuck. Yo, what's going on today, man? I mean, where you coming from today? I'm in my house. Your house? I mean, where's your house at? Yep. The uh, block, uh, east. Okay, alright, I'm gonna go to patch you down. You got anything on you that's gonna stick me, poke me, harm, harm you? I'm, I'm gonna go and explain everything to you in a second, alright? But I just need to patch you down real quick. Alright. Um, my cell phone's in my right pocket and I've got some uh, socks uh, down my pants. Okay, wait, can I just ask why you have socks in your pants? You have socks? Socks on you? I mean... I mean... You wouldn't want to know anyway. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna just take that, alright? Alright, go ahead and face me real quick. Is that your car right there? No. So that's not your car? Nope. Okay, what are you doing over here then? I'm just there for a, a stroll. This out for a stroll. That's funny because as soon as I was rolling up, I seen you actually walking from the car towards the stairs. So I don't see how that's possible. That this is not your car, or how you wasn't operating a car. All right. So you're gonna be honest with me now, or are you gonna go ahead and continue? No, I'm continuing live. I mean, yeah, turn around for me real quick. Turn around. Uh, turn uh, around real quick. Uh, what's what's that on your hands? Is that? Uh, I got that blood? Uh, I punched the wall. You punched the no. wall? Why'd you? I mean, when'd you punch the wall? Well, you got mad? Um, yeah. Okay, alright, so I'm gonna go to say and explain to you why we got handcuffs on you. We got a 911 call about a pedestrian being, sh um, pedestrian being hit. And, um, you know, we was, we, was, we was given a description of this vehicle. So that's why, uh, you know, that's why any handcuffs right now. And from the way it's looking at, um, looks like he was definitely operating that vehicle, and uh, we're gonna actually gonna go and find out. So you're not, you know, you're being detained right now. You're not being arrested, but um, you know, your vehicle does match the description, um, you know, and relates of that crime that just occurred, all right? I mean, there's plenty of people wearing wearing gray swells. Okay, but you gotta understand, uh, I, you know, like the last, the last known location was Marina Drive, and as I was rolling up to Marina Drive, that's when I seen you walking away from the car. So that's my probable cause of detaining you right now. So like I said, you're not being arrested, you're just being detained, all right? I'm gonna go ahead and put you inside my cruiser until we can go ahead and figure this out, all right? All right. All right. Okay. Um, dude, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at your vehicle. And uh, just go ahead and just hang tight for me. You got a first name? You got a you got a you got a first name last name for me? I didn't find any. Um, um, I didn't find any uh, identification on you. Yeah, my name's uh, Paper Billy. Okay, you want to go ahead and type that in text chat so I can remember it? Yeah, Thank sure you. thing. Hey, um, highway. Um, would you mind going and search his car? Um, yeah, you know we got a nine one call about a pedestrian being struck. At um on Marina Drive at the 24/7, the last known location was over here. So that's when I came over here, and uh, you know I seen him walking away from the car. I didn't really see him getting out of the car. I just seen him walking away from the car. So I'm assuming that he was operating the car. And uh, you know we can go to run the plate. Yes, yeah. he, he has some blood on his hand. I don't know what's going on with that. He, he said he punched a wall. 
Yeah, so I'm just running 1027, 1029 now, right, just ahead. wait, wait until they come back. Turn your mic down just a little bit. If you could. Yes, yeah, so I'm just running 1027, 1029 now, just waiting for it to come back. Okay, alright, perfect. Alright, so while you do that, I'm gonna go ahead and um, search the car real quick just to make sure there's nothing in there since he's being detained. Uh, alright, 10 full. Oh, okay. Alright, guys, we're gonna go ahead and search the car. We're not too sure if this is actually a guy we're looking for, but maybe it is, maybe it's not. But um, let's just actually. Just go around the car just to make sure, you know, there's no type of evidence on the car. Um, looks like I spot some blood. Spot, I do see, I, I do spot some blood stains on the vehicle. Nice, sure. Got the 1027, 1029 back. Okay, alright, um, yeah, it looks like, uh, looks like in between of the left and right. Um, headlight, I see some blood splatter right there. Um, it actually looks like the vehicle's looks like the vehicle has recently been in an accident, like a minor fender bender possibly. But it, I do I do see blood on the, the front uh, the the front of the vehicle. So. Did, did you hear me? Yeah, it's also blood on the rear of the vehicle. Oh, okay, yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, so he has blood on his hands. I don't know if he tried to wipe the car before we actually pulled up or not, but obviously he had, you know, he touched, he had some part of this. You know, that's just not really matching up right now. Yeah. We got the vehicle coming back to the same description. Um, you know, we were placing him at mm -hmm. the, you know, at the crime scene. I can go ahead and head down to the 2007 to see if I can get some type of footage to see if this is actually the car we're looking for. But as far as right now, we have, you know, we pretty much have a lot to go, um, you know, to go off of arrest right now. All yeah, so the vehicle's up. registered to Billy Piper, uh, two previous DUIs. Okay. All right, perfect. And um, is that um, is that him? My everything matches up, right? He doesn't have any warrants or anything? No, so there's no warrants, uh, just the two previous DUIs. Okay, all right, perfect. All right, so, um, yeah, so we pretty much got everything we need. Um, you know, we can possibly play, we can place him at the crime scene. Um, you know, we got the vehicle description. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at the 24/7. So can you go ahead and take him out of my car and put him in your car and book him? And um, I'm gonna go ahead into the 24/7 and see if I can get some type of footage from him. But you know, we got pretty much everything we need. We got him. Um, we got the vehicle, like I said, and we got the blood splatter on, and you know, the, the blood splatter on the car. So that's pretty much all we need for the rest. But I just want to go ahead and just um, try to see if I can figure something out. All right, have you read him as right yet? Um, no, no, I haven't. No, last time I talked to him, he was only being detained. But now that he, um, you know, now that all the evidence is concluded, we can actually go ahead and arrest him. So, um, yeah, I go ahead and read him his rights, and then um, I'm going to take him out of my car and can put him inside yours, and I'll go ahead and check him out to 24/7. All right, ten four. Okay. All right. Uh, can you go ahead and just get towed for that car real quick? Yes, sure. Hey, man, DM, Mr. Billy, hear me? Um, yeah. Okay. Alright, uh, so right now, at this moment, you are being placed on arrest, you're not being detained anymore. Um, so right now, you have been placed at the crime scene, your vehicle is coming back, um, as, you know, coming back as a match to the vehicle who, um, that was involved with the, um, hit and run. So right now, you are being placed on arrest, you do have the right to remain silent, anything you say, can do, will be held against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney, if you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to you. With those rights tomorrow, with those rights I have given to you today, do you wish to speak to me? I do wish to speak, um, I had a deal. Um, truthfully, that's uh, my car, um, and I hit, I hit a deer. I went 60. That's why there's blood there. It's, it's not like I had to pick the deer up. Um, so you hit a deer. And that's why there's blood. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I mean, like you're gonna 15, have to go. 15 minutes ago. 15 minutes ago. You, well, you're gonna have to go ahead and explain that to the court, because right now we got all the evidence that we need to put you at the crime scene. And, uh, you know, to actually place a vehicle at the crime scene as well. But we're actually going to go ahead and do a little bit more investigation. But as far as I can tell you right now, you will be in place on arrest for that, um, for the hit and run, right? And um, oh. obviously, you know, it's going to be up to the yeah. courts to go ahead and decide whether you're guilty or not, all right? I mean, can, can I get a badge number? Uh, badge number? Badge number is three, Charlie 347. You're going to take that. You remember, I can write it down and send it to you later on if you need it. Yeah, if you could do that. And what's this guy's? That's a uh, that's a uh, white white trash over there. What's his name? Um, yeah, you have to ask him. Yo, white trash. Oh, okay, like, do like don't even talk to him. Don't don't even talk to you him. Talking to you talking to me? No, no, do like don't even talk to him. He's yeah, I'm do, talking. Do, to you. Do, don't talk to him. I'm gonna go ahead and book him. And actually, I'll go ahead and finish off finish off the business later. 
No, 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 you, no, no. Oh, oh right, you're you're required you're to give me your name. Yo. Alright, guys, so he's being completely. Can he hear me? Completely hey, disrespectful well done right now. So I can speak to this guy. I'm actually gonna go ahead and close down, close the cage. Officer. Alright, so it looks like we got all that set. This guy actually gonna take these high beams oh, off. Didn't know my high beams was off. I just shut him up real quick, so. Alright, we're gonna be en route back to the sheriff's department to go ahead and book this guy in for the um, hit and run. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't really mm -hmm. hear him right now, so he's back there mumbling. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and head back, go ahead and book him and process him. Hopefully, he doesn't act, you know, arrogant as, you know, how's he been acting lately, so. Mm -hmm. Open the fuck with me. Open the fuck with me. Alright, go ahead and step out. Go ahead and face my door. Peg. Face my car. You fucking peg. Yep, yeah, I can be yep, yeah, I can be that. I can be that. I can be what all of that. That's perfectly fine. You had you had a deal and you get arrested, what's this? This is America. Well, it's up to the course to go ahead and, you know, prove that, alright? Go ahead and face this door. <clears throat> I mean, you don't, you don't have to pick me in, really. Like, yeah, I mean, and you only saw me walking down the street, like... Alright, sir, so you are aware of your rights, right? And you are aware of what you're being charged for? I'm aware. Okay. And all right, will. so I'm gonna go ahead and take a couple of pictures of you. I'm gonna go ahead and take your handcuffs off. All right, the door is locked. You're not gonna be able to go nowhere. So don't try, don't try anything. All right. Uh, I won't. All right, I don't consent to any pictures. All right, I have to take pictures. That's mandatory. So that's my private face. All right, go ahead and face me. All right, stay right there. Don't take a picture. It's my private face. Oh! I'm fucking. Gonna watch your mouth, man. Going to, am I going to take a? Am I going to take a step to the left? Turn around. Face the left side. Nah, you can keep your eyes closed all you want. That's perfectly fine. As long as you get your face, that's all that matters. All right, going to turn to the right side. If I can't see you, you can't see me. All right, now go ahead and face the desk. Yeah, you're gonna get pitch mass and zoom in. Alright, so you're gonna go in and get booked, alright? Everything is taken care of. You're gonna go in and book. There's gonna be an officer that back there is gonna go in and take you in, right? Okay. I'll see you in court. Cool. Uh, oh, okay. Oh. I'll see you in court, cool, officer. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this episode, man. I'm, um, I